How Government Programs Hurt Small Producers USDA announces $25 million for agricultural entrepreneurs to turn commodities into value-added products. USDA is investing $25 million to help 247 businesses nationwide expand their operations and create new products to market, Secretary Vilsack said today during a visit to Miles Smith Farm in Loudoun, New Hampshire, a recipient of one of the grants. The funding is being provided through USDA Rural Development's Value Added Producer Grant Program. The program helps agricultural producers grow their businesses by turning raw commodities into value added products, expanding marketing opportunities, and developing new uses for existing products. The funding we are announcing today will have far reaching, positive impacts in rural communities across the country, Bill Sack said. The investments will help businesses create new products, expand their operations, and support local and regional food systems. The new farm bill expands this program to provide even more of these opportunities. Since 2009, USDA has awarded 863 value-added producer grants totaling $108 million. The 2014 farm bill increases mandatory funding for the program from $15 million to $63 million over five years, while also reauthorizing an additional $40 million in discretionary funding. They can support local and regional food systems, further the development of the growing bioeconomy, and finance the distribution of local and regional products. By mixing ground pork with extra lean, grass-fed ground beef, the farm can produce a burger with the ideal fat and flavor levels that grass-fed ground beef does not have alone. Miles Smith Farm's owner calls the mix the burger that squeals with flavor. In neighboring Vermont, North Hollow Farm LLC in Rochester, is receiving a $161,204 grant to expand processing and marketing of grass-fed beef and natural meats. Farmy Market Online LLC in Rensselaerville, New York, has been selected for a $24,490 grant to expand its online presence for 16 small farmers who produce a broad range of fresh foods that are aggregated and sold online, expanding their customer base. Value-added producer grants are an element of USDA's Know Your Farmer, Know Your Food initiative, which coordinates USDA's work to support local and regional food systems. USDA is awarding value-added producer grants in 46 states, Puerto Rico and Micronesia. Since enactment, USDA has made significant progress to implement each provision of this critical legislation, including providing disaster relief to farmers and ranchers, strengthening risk management tools, expanding access to rural credit, funding critical research, establishing innovative public-private conservation partnerships, developing new markets for rural-made products, and investing in infrastructure, housing and community facilities to help improve the quality of life in rural America. For more information, visit www.usda.gov slash farm bill. This release ends with amazing propaganda praising our exalted leader. President Obama's historic investments in rural America have made our rural communities stronger. For starters, these programs have been ongoing for decades, long before Obama came on the scene. What is worse is that this form of community support wastes taxpayer money and provides unfair advantages to many businesses that should not survive. For the USDA to believe that it needs to help one grass-fed meat producer expand and market grass-fed beef products and help another invest in a website for the very purpose of making them more competitive against all the rest of us in the industry is additional idiocy. Recently we invested considerable funds of our own in a new website.